Hey YouTube, it's Ed Johnson here, and today is the third part of our HTML tutorials. Today I'm going to be showing you how to add images to your websites, so let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is you want to create a folder. Mine's called Website, uh, you can call yours whatever you want. Um, and inside the folder you want image or images that you want to add to your website. Mine's just called Image and it's an example image. Um, so now you want to open up Notepad. Um, I'm going to maximize it and I'm going to type in the HTML standard tags. You should have learned these if you watched my previous videos. If not, um, refer back to the them and this will make a lot more sense. So the HTML, the head and the title tag, the title that you want, uh, and close the head tag and open the body tag. Um, now the new tag, IMG SRC equals open speech marks. Now we'll go back to the folder where the image is, and as you can see it's called image, and it's a, dot, uh, it's a PNG extension file. So we're going to put in the src image, uh, image dot png. Close speech marks and close the tag. Uh, this is, um, and you want to save it, you want to make sure it's saved in the website folder. So the same location, you want to make sure it's saved as the same location as the image. So index.html or whatever you want.html. Uh, and now I'm going to open the HTML document that we've created here. Uh, it opens up in Firefox, and as you can see, there's the image. Um, it's there, plain to see. And now I'm going to show you what happens if you don't save it in the correct location. So if we save, um, if say we save this to the desktop where the image isn't, uh, the image isn't present, um, and open it up, you'll get an error. Um, it says it can't it can't find um, the image because it's not in the desktop location. It's in a totally different folder. So that's what happens if you um, save it to the wrong place. Uh, it simply can't find the image that it wants to load up, and that's what happens. Um, I'm going to show you how to add a border now. Um, border uh, equals open speech marks, however many you want, a number. Uh, PX. PX stands for pixels. Close speech marks and close the tag. Um, open up the HTML document. Oh, it hasn't worked. It hasn't worked because we're saving it to the desktop still. Um, we want to save it to the website folder. Um, .html. Save that. Um, and refresh. And as you can see, you've got a 5 pixel width border. Uh, the default color for the border is black. We're going to change the border to 20 pixels. Uh, just to give you another example, refresh the page, and there you go, it's 20 pixels um, around the image file that you've got. So that's how to add a solo image, how to add a single image. Now I'm going to show you how to add a background image. This is my background. Um, so you can add whatever text or whatever content you want here. And in the body tag, you want body space background equals open speech marks and the image uh, file again. So in our case, it's image.png. Uh, it can be JPEG, PNG, GIF, JPG, um, there's a whole range of them. And click refresh. And as you can see, the background image has repeated itself again and again. Um, and there's the text. This is my background. Um, so that's how to add uh, images and, in, and background images to your file. Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe for more videos soon.